Roses also have thorns. That's a proverb from a community called Igbo in Nigeria. Now, two angles of the same. Of course, we know that roses are very beautiful flowers that are cherished globally. People love them. People love roses. But you realize that as beautiful as it is, as presentable and valuable as it is, it still has thorns. What are we trying to say? There is nothing good that does not have challenges. There is nowhere you will go to that you won't find a few challenges here and there. There is no perfect environment without some pricking of thorns. And so, if you think you will go anywhere and won't find challenges, if you think you'll deal with anyone and won't find challenges, remember this proverb that even roses have thorns. How about human beings that are prone to challenges, that are prone to mistakes, that have the innate weaknesses? They are there. The other angle of the same is that as you're going to pluck the rose, you also be prepared to score some pricking of the thorns. What are we trying to say? There is nothing good that comes on a silver platter. That good life that you want, that rosy life that you want, that rosy marriage that you, that you want, that rosy career that you want, that rosy business that you want, you'll have to be pricked by the thorns of that rose in the process of acquiring it. You'll have to experience some, some challenges and if you're the type that wants to slay all through, you'll not get it. Why? Because you, you fear the pricking of the thorns. The thorns will prick you. Look at it, wipe the blood and continue plucking it because that is how to get a valuable thing. There is nothing you admire that came by luck. It came by work. Luck follows work. Luck follows consistency. Luck follows dedication. Luck does not associate with laziness. Tell me any lazy person that got something by luck. It could be someone else worked for it, that it got it by a splash. Even roses have thorns. Endure the pricking of thorns if you want to have that rose. Thank you.